Yo no jumper, you already know Mr. I am next hood at bro. And right now I'm in Brixton and I'm about to give you the low down the scope on a legend. The one and only RA. Listen, if you don't know, you're gonna find out today. Is it me? Yeah, we're in the bricks right now. This is the home of the brave, love yeah. rock, you know how the thing's set. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is my dog, he dropped out. Rest in peace. You know? Yeah. Legendary ham, you get me? Yeah, I get you. For people who don't know who is RA. Well, it is. I'm, I'm just me in it, far over it. Yeah. Last of the, the dying breed, there's not many like man. No yeah, one, yeah, yeah. that material got extinct. No <laughs> one there, yeah. it's finished. Um, you and your guys were doing it different to a lot of other guys, you lot were doing grime. Yeah, Do yeah, you yeah. get what I mean? Or gangster grime, if you can say that. What, yeah. um, what made you jump on that and not hip hop or the rap thing? You know what it is? I always saw a rap as an American thing. Okay. Like when I was coming up. When we were coming up, yeah. no one weren't really doing UK rap. No yeah, one yeah. wasn't actually. It was garage. Yeah. Not even garage, jungle. Okay. Yeah. So was it before So Solid or after So Solid? No, before So Solid. Jungle days. I'm okay. talking like Skipper D and that. Okay, okay. Old school, them legendary artists is there, you got yeah. me? So that was before So Solid, but then obviously So Solid. 100%. They set the order for the South thing as well, you get Yeah, yeah, facts. You always have to get in their dues. Prepare to die, die. Hate on my clips till we're going sky high. I tell you why. So sorry, you were hot in the disc with no miss. Check the credits on top of the list. Ayo, so. What? Yeah. Man was, man was pre in the, the music thing from Jungle Days, you get me? Yeah. And then obviously, it switched to Garage and then Grime. But obviously, with the Grime thing, with us, man's thinking, raw, man don't do American rap. Yeah. You know what I'm gonna say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. In that, the, the rap thing just felt more yeah, it was American. Yeah, more American. Everyone was doing, everyone was doing American. And sounding American with yeah. their flows. And then, and, some man, if, and then if anyone over here spitting um, 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 rap, they're sounding American in that. Yeah, that, weren't, that weren't man's thing. Yeah. Our thing was original jungle, garage yeah and grind you get me yeah 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 that was our thing so i just stuck to our thing you get me yeah, yeah but yeah. obviously man weren't doing the fancy pop type of garage thing because man was really knee deep in the streets in so, the streets yeah. so so man's thing come off a gangster grime mm. so man spitting smoke and this is what we live man was knee deep from young i was a youth that got kicked out of nursery not yeah. one when you talk about knee deep and my influences were um i was i was a dance school man innit? okay the yard thing, that was man's thing that's yeah, my yeah, yeah. Man's background so where everyone was growing up listening to american thing Man's thing was bounty killer. Okay. Yeah. You're full of clarity, me clear. You're just that man. While I'd appear them drop like chandelier. And, and, and merciless and ninja man. And yeah, man. yeah, yeah, yeah. That was man's thing that. that was, that's, that's what was playing in my yard when I was growing up. Yeah. As a youth. So them thing that they stuck with man. And if you know bounty killer, he just took straight smoke. Yeah. And yeah, yeah. anything that came down from him, cartel. My vado did it. Put the sun on them phone box now. And what the majority? They were man's influences. Um, their man started listening to like rap. Yeah. After that, you get it. Like, okay. But they weren't man's influences. Like, the brother that like, was pulled up, you didn't even see him. Obviously, that's Smiley. Obviously, he created the whole Two Dark. Because before Real Side it was Two Dark crew. Okay. So this is Luff, bro, where we at now, Father Peace. And this was just like the home of all the, the, the artists. You get yeah, 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 yeah. Obviously, I was a young buck coming up. Them man, they were older than man, you get me? Okay. So obviously, and, and I could spit. I could spit in it. I was yeah. spitting from on the jump. So the bros and when they're going radio and I'm saying, yeah, I'm floating, man. I, can, yeah. I got bars. You get me? Yeah. And it was just a normal thing, but it was always a, a roadside thing because it was man's. This is where we come from. This is where you right here, right here, man. Done like an old school freestyle. I think the same one where you're saying about um, um, so now nah, um, I'm in a t-shirt. I'm in a t-shirt. It was summertime. Man was out here. I think Shaq and that was out here. Yeah. Bro. Them niggas listen to House and Funky, we listen to Bounty Killer and Sister Kalunji. And this is yeah. me and our own shit because of grungy. Every day I'm in the jungle shutting him. But before I was obviously heard that freestyle from Shaq where he's like free, free RA, and I was like, who's RA in a relationship? Yeah, obviously with Shaq. Now remember, remember, we grew up together, innit? Okay. That's from the same ends. It's like he's a young boy, I'm a young boy. We was from the same ends, different estates. My brother RA for me from behind the wall. And the homie said to me, right. Everyone's doing pound cake, how come I ain't did a pound cake, you feel me? I told him it's long, but everyone did it. He said, fuck that, I don't mind, everyone did it. You know, when we do it, we do it proper, so make them know what a real pound cake is. But it was all just one connection, innit? Like, it's the cool man, Razor, you get it? Okay. The man always had that. And obviously, it was always like sharp like a, a razor, you get me? So, 
Mama's youth, so I'm talking juveniles, you know the man then? 12, 13. Because I, I made a lyric called R A Z O R, you get me? Mm. Like with Mama's youth. And then, so when I said R A, people just used to start saying R A, you get me? Yeah. Man's old now, so man can't be being called Razor, you get me? Man's a big boy, you get me? So yeah. obviously. It just dropped down to this real artillery. Yeah, upgraded yeah. from whatever man was doing before to artillery now. Um, <laughs> who was the rappers like or the artists at that time that were prominent in that era? Just so people have an understanding of like the landscape. PDC, you see, know, the bricks can't go around that. Foundation, you get me? Yeah. So PDC, when it comes to rap on the south side, I would I would say even even the south side alone, bro. Call horns, just the P D C. Bang bang PDC. Yeah. Rap. None of that. No Spotify, no YouTube, no nothing, bro. It was just straight boxing CDs. And if you had a link for certain radio um, radio DJ, that's how your things get spin. Or, yeah. or channel U, you get me? Or yeah, yeah. MTV base. You know the one there? Yeah, yeah, facts. And that's how that's how so man and man boxes of, of, of CDs, bro. And man and man's pulling up at, at certain shops and just dropping up boxes like it's food. You know the one there? Shopkeepers are phoning me back like, oh we sold this much, come for this much bread, whatever you get. Yeah, yeah. Bare DVD, sticky business. I view images, streets incarcerated, all of that you get. Yeah, that was the like the UK's YouTube at the time. Yeah, DVDs, that was a gold to. So yeah, yeah, you have to be someone and buy that life to even get on a DVD. And and, and majority of the times the cameraman's half about that life as well. The <laughs> car. Remember, they're not coming to the hood. Yeah. The average Joe ain't gonna come to the hood in a garrison, dark estate come and feel bare man where things are going in man no normal random donny don't, don't want to come and float and risk filming and something crazy going off you get me yeah uh, war so, kitchen freestyle how old are you at that time i was 17 or 16 then Roadside cheese. R A is R A W. Bullets from the Mac 10 will smother you. Like a bed sheet, they'll cover you. I've never been a prick or afraid of another you. You know what it is? Man had talent, bro, yeah? Yeah. But man was just too like, you get it? Too too yeah, in, in the too yeah. in the road. And it's, when I think about it, it's stupid now, you get me? Yeah, that right. was man's height. Get, get that door and um, can't come to the roadside. They were man big tunes. I'm not to the roadside. Can't come to the roadside, hit MTV bass and that, and this is like, oh, get that door is 04. Hit the streets and hustle if need be. Get that door, that door. Invest in food and buy sticks like five in a row. Don't get robbed or let them thing they were going on bass and that back then, bro. Yeah. 2004, man was in the charts and MTV bass, you get And at the time, you guys were still deep in the streets. Still deep in the streets, and then obviously, that's what I'm saying, that happened. Can't come to the roadside came out. Then we was on MTV base. We was in the charts. We was like number two in the charts. The next week, there was no charts. Man weren't even in the charts. Man weren't even ten. How? Man saying, "Raw, what going?" When the people them hollered up, um, up at the um, the people them like, "Raw, what going?" How come the nothing's on there at all? They said, "Raw." Um, they said, "Obviously, police have, 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 have contacted us and, and told us down. and told and told us that we can't." Um, be entertaining um, gang members. These these people are real gang members, so you can't be entertaining. And they shut us down. I remember we're trying to get out of the badness. Yeah. We're trying to get out of the streets, and the jigs are trying to hold us back in. So that's what happened. It shut us down, and, it, and, and they just blocked us. Radio weren't effing with us. Get me. The only people that I say, and up to this day, is Logan Sama. Okay. He's the yeah, only yeah, one. Yeah. He's the only one that carried on playing man's things and still called man up to shows and that. You get. It? That's yeah. why I remember to always respect Logan. Like, so like, even even looking at. The, the current state of music now, like in Grime. drill. Yeah. Can you see that the influences from? Of course, because it's the same tempo as Grime. That's the exact same tempo as Grime, my guy. Yeah. So 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 it's drill, isn't it? Like the same thing. That's why I would just mash up a drill beat, and no one can't tell me nothing. Mm. I just I just spit all over a drill, a drill beat, and disrespect a drill beat. Easy, because it's man's Grime. That's man's Grime for thing, isn't it? It's man's same tempo. Mm. So yeah, of course, that definitely had influence in drill. No matter if they like it or not. I remember bare people doing classy garage and this garage, this that. Man and, came and changing and, their voice, go, doing yeah, that. And, and making sound effects and all of that. Yeah. But, but that's good for them if that's, that, that's what they want to do. But man's thing was just thorough, like it's just straight hard hitting. This is what it is, reality. And if people them know man or you know of man, you know like right, these youths are thorough youths. That's what they're saying is factual. You know the man. And that was that was just our thing. So we our thing was gangster grime. So you had grime. The normal gram, but then but you our had, thing was gangster gram. Yeah, because right? even back then, like when I look at artists, like the only artists that I can see who were kind of doing that gangster gram thing was like Crazy Titch. 
Yeah, yeah, teaching that. Shout out, teaching that. That's my dog still. And like, well. guess. Love a glove and a machine. You weren't tucking as a teen. I was on the way before I had color in my screen round here every summer. Yeah, yeah, there probably was. But man, set it. Mm, set it that smoky. Smoke. Now, you know what? You have to give your hats off to. Uh, to, uh, to Titch and Ghetto as well. Yeah. They were over there talking it as well. Yeah. So, but they were on the east side, didn't it? Yeah. So the whole old Trizzy thing, old Trey, da, 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 it all started here. Yeah, this is one's a fraud, didn't it? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, obviously, Bear Man went jail and that. And... Yeah, before we did that, the Welcome to the City freestyle, same time when Jules Santana got his, his things tech wet. <laughs> so let's cut to the chase. What's going on? Did man kidnap Santana? Right, it's real. The real essay. Real essay. Oh, no. Come and think of it, it was 2008, early, kinda. I can't let it slide. I see them niggas, I go get my nine. Cause when, Cause when it's repping time, I delete them niggas with a weapon of mine. I bump they hustle, hustle, I bump their hustle, I'm checking the grind. I put the work with the ant things, but I ride the six pants at a separate old school. Old Sounds good. Like mad even saying it again out here. Yeah. With certain situations, it ended up you having to take time inside, didn't it? Mm. Like, how long did you have to do it? Full 10. Not 10 do 5, like a full 10 years. And kind of just effed up everything. So when man's doing music now, the other day I heard someone say, ah, oh, that new guy, oh, hey, he's hard. Yeah. yeah, like the guy yeah. thinks I'm new, but obviously it's just what it is, isn't it? The youth's young. He, he, you get you me? Know. Like, you don't know the foundation. Don't know the when I went to jail, you were probably about seven. Okay. I'm gonna say six, <laughs> eight. Imagine that. That's how long man's gone to where yeah. now man's come back. People think man's new, isn't it? Like this is the sort of kids stay in school, innit? Like I said, innit? Tell your tell your tell your kids to stay in school, bro, man. It makes sense to get one to the jailhouse. It's a crazy thing, and if you're not fit for it, you get broken down mm. to pieces. Like when glass shatters, you get what I'm gonna say to you? Yeah. You know, it's always the normal thing, stabbings, people dying. I see beer man dead in jail. I see enough man get killed in jail. I swear to But the newspapers don't tell you about that. Jail. Yeah, I was in 13 different jails. Cheap. I was a slight little problem at one stage. Wait, how old did you go in? 23. Okay. Like so man went jail. What man went jail for? Man didn't even do. Yeah. Man got fully stitched up, edicting. And the law, the system, actually sent someone to jail for mad years and they wasn't even involved in what they sent man jail for. So mm. I was a problem in my time in it. So I just feel like they just wanted me not to strip so there's pattern. So I was just upset with everything. So man just crashing on everyone and that is is what it is and it yeah. And man was in the gruesome jails as well. Man were in the little jails where man just go and do Roman and feel like that's jail. So enough of these men get you know, twisted. They go Thames side and feel like yeah man we're in jail like Thames side ain't jail. What yeah. was the worst jail that you say you went to? And it was just going off. Uh, you know what? It's either out of Larton and Gartree. Oh, where were they? So Larton's in Eversham. Probably even heard of that. Eversham? Eversham, Queen in the Bush. So Queen. That, that's a serious job, it's a high security job. And Gartree was in Leicester. Leicester Shire. Leicester Shire. Not Leicester. Leicester Shire. Queen in the Bush as well. But that job was a lifer's job. You get me? Okay. So everyone in there's got a body. So you know everyone's walking around with some different ego. Yeah. Yeah. Because you can't go there unless you've got a, a, a corpse. When you gotta think of it, you're in a jail like that. Everyone thinks they're bad boys. Yeah, it's just bare testosterone. Yeah, everyone's man. everyone's bad boys. So certain men are arguing like, "Raw, like you got more bodies than me." Like, that's what I hear man arguing about. Mm. So that that jail there, if you weren't on joints, you'll get savaged up quick, chewed up and spit spit out ASAP. Larton, man in there ain't on no play plating either. And man would just do you. The man would just done your dance. Butter in a in a pot, like the whole the whole tub of butter in a pot, and boil it for two hours. And then it turns into a, 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 a liquid that's hotter than oil. This thing here is peak, like acid, you know what I'm saying? And I just see man just get that, like, tsh, like a man's whole skeleton just, tsh, man's skin just moved off his skeleton. Yeah, you know, like, obviously, you got harsh things going on in it, so tell the youth them to stay in school, bro, because you don't want to go in them jail and buck up on, on them artists there, you get me? Mm. So man don't glorify Joe. When man hear me talk about Joe in my bars and that, it's just that, brother, I've just been there for 10 years. Yeah. So that's what man know right about now. But yeah, F jail, jail's a waste man thing. Man going jail is it's long. Yeah, good. So while whilst being in jail, like what kept you motivated, like? Man's Dean as well, you get me? Okay. Man's Dean, man's religion has kept man grounded and that, you get me? And it's kept man You see what it is, one thing you gotta remember, you see stress bro. Yeah. Stress is a killer itself, you know, my guy. See if you know how to manage your stress you can overcome beer things, bro. You know mm. what I'm gonna say to you? I see man in jail stress and have a heart attack. Like man who was fit like a fiddle, he just died in his bed, heart attack. 
because I used to talk to him, he used to tell me his situation. This, I went to a jail, I think it was Loud and Grange, and they had a studio there. I said, rah, boom, booth time. And I slapped up the booth quickly, you get me? <laughs> and I was like, rah, like I just run, run certain rhythms that I hear out there, bam, patterned it, and then I sent the tunes out, you get me? Mm. So there was a tune called Mockery. Jay Lyle's thing, free my fucking brothers. Listen, they ain't never seen an underground shit. Cash back in JA, I see the underground kick. Life, I think you get me. From a palm to a jib, from the brown to the sniff, from a house in the bricks to a house in the sticks, from an eight. Mm, I sent them from jail. That was fresh from the jail, so the mix is dead, everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But man put it out there and it got bare um Traction. people are feeling it like rah, like and so people remembered man's thing. So I was like, oh Oh, you found your favorite yeah, yeah, in jail. Yeah, 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 that's when you got time to read, didn't it? Yeah. When you're on road, you ain't got time to read. Man them used to give me dower and that, but man weren't. Man was just like, yeah, man, da, 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 and you, get, you wanna pray or you wanna get closer to whatever you wanna get closer to. How do you do it? It's the only way, innit? So, but I was a youth, I grew up like, as um, my mother and father are rats, innit, you get? Yeah. So I grew up under that order, innit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it was yeah. just normal, it was just a culture thing. So I knew the Rastafarian side of this. And then I started reading into the Christianity. They're all different, you get it? Okay. Certain times, man would just come out, boom, and man's moving. Or, 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 or said something out of place I was crashing there and then you got on his age but then obviously them things are kind of just the dean that's what I'm saying the dean humbled me like yo have Tamed more peace flame. yeah have more peace in this thing Parabellum that's my mixtapes out soon we're, work, we're working on that now it's finished now and we're just doing a couple of little bits and pieces what does that mean Parabellum and you're getting ready for war okay and then obviously it's, it's the name of a um, binds or corn corn I don't want to oh, okay, yeah, okay. whoever knows knows isn't it you get me <laughs> Yeah, you can't, I can't yeah, take you there. I know people is on them, but yeah, it's, 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 a, it's, a good, it's a big step still. Yeah. Movie signs, man. Movie signs. Alright, cool, man. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, you know what it is. Come the second realist shooter in the building. After me. Come on, Salford. You about me? You about me? You about me? You about me? Jim Brown. Jim Brown, man. Why Word. Jim Brown? Like, I did some research on who he was and that. Yeah, because that, that was me, innit? In my time, innit? Bro? Jim yeah. Brown, bro. Like, that was it, innit? Like, I was the Jim Brown on my ends. Okay. Before, like, but remember, people always focus on the bad things with Jim Brown. Obviously, there was good in him as well, innit? So, yeah. He was an area leader in Tivoli Gardens in Jamaica. So he was a don. So he was a general of his entire area. And it was one order. So anything he says goes. Mm. So like, in... in and that's man's thing, yard, isn't it? Yard and abroad. So obviously, I felt like, yeah, that's my thing anyway. And that's man's history, so let's do it, isn't it? Jim Brown to the world. Yeah, a proper project, man. Yeah, proper on, project. On there, um, you had like features with like gigs, gets, mm. snap, yeah, yeah, on yeah. ads. Couple, couple big names, Fredo as well. The gigs thing is, is, a, is, a, is bigger than just the music. Because mm. like, obviously, I know just from being from South, like, Brixton and Peckham were rivals at a, yeah, a certain yeah, point. Yeah, yeah, so how did that come about? Like, for the crook, go catch me a box. See him buying food the cash in the shop. We pay three for cash on a box. Still got a four for stash on the block. Like a missed call, man, drank back. Big pistol, man, drank back. It was a, um, a genuine link up, innit? Like, yeah. Man, 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 them spoke. And it was like, right, like, man was looking to make, man making music out, innit? What we really do beef, like. Don't make sense in it, kind of thing, in it. So, from that, yeah, but so you see me, I rap about what I want to rap about. Okay. So it's like I'm not like obviously last the last rap the last rapper people were saying oh you didn't rap about this you didn't rap about that you didn't talk about this but I didn't talk about that because I didn't want you. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm That's the difference. Like, I didn't didn't want you in it. So obviously, but because everyone was like this, so obviously this one now I said well 2020 let me just add a bit more spice to it. You know what I'm saying? Home and he's take charted, nines drop crap in a bucket and it charted. Storms killed Wiley, it ended before it started. Same Millions way. came through Duncan, had the ball up, shot a fin. Shout out Ox Beats as well, man. You know, he's a young, young producer, he's on, he's on a smoke still. Yeah. I'm talking about more combat when man was young. Okay. Mega Drive and that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you got to see. And then even Mega Drive and then, and then PlayStation 1. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, like that era. After that, it stopped for me, innit? I want a combat specialist, man. Yeah, who was your character? Um, 
Raiden. Yeah, my guy. Raiden was my, my guy. My, Raiden's my guy. Raiden was on joints, you get me? Yeah, fact. So yeah, you just based the new tune off that, and then the remix was cold, man. The way obviously you got had M24, mm. Nole, it was very diverse, man. Proper. Yeah, I tried to put something different together. You get me? Yeah. How, many, how many times have they shipped man out from jail to jail? So racist, out air been nicked for M's and attempted M's. Don't think you can face it. How much times had feds at my door to my next door? Yeah. What about Kemzy? Like that was a new one. I didn't even expect that one. Yeah, yeah, something to say, but obviously he. With Kemzy, I see, I see one of his freestyles, isn't it? Yeah. One freestyle when he just came out, and it was cold. And I, and I just instantly draw to him. I said, nah, this dude's cold, man. The way he was talking, only if you're about that life, you could mention certain things. Or you're not going to know certain things, what he was saying, you get? Mm. So I just took to him instantly, like, yeah, this dude's cold. Off the new tape, yeah? Bust your gun and shut your mouth, shut your mouth. I call my name when they talk about work, that's putting us south. You ain't been through shit, you ain't never had beef and it's all in house. Not even like that anyway. Like With a man that you're beefing, know your house. Uh -oh. Know your mum, know your dad, know your spouse. Shit's, Shit's so deep, I'll sleep with that pole inside your house. Uh -huh. Countless times, have you banged and banged and banged in the open. Uh -huh. When me and little bro went and mashed the work, I told him, keep your eyes open. Next to the next to the WWF. Yeah, that was cool. very major. Hear this now. WWF. WWF. <laughs> that way. WWF, you better call that Undertaker. He got one in his chest and put in the air like a bunch of flavor. Seems like 